The Premier has launched an extraordinary attack on the organisers of a tent city that's growing in the heart of Fremantle. Mark McGowan says those claiming to be homeless aren't homeless at all. Elizabeth Creasy, he says anarchists are exploiting disadvantaged people. Well, Michael, dozens of people are sleeping rough in this park right now, which also happens to be right opposite the office for the Minister for Community Services. The Premier says, though, that some of these people actually do have alternative accommodation available to them uh, and that they, this camp has been set up by a professional protest group which is taking advantage of some of our most vulnerable. It's a home for the homeless, Pioneer Park in the heart of Fremantle, now a tent city. I just come down here because it's safety in numbers. It's been growing for weeks and is equipped with toilets and a makeshift kitchen. But the Premier says some of these people aren't homeless at all. I'm quite frustrated by this. I'm quite frustrated. Um, there are professional protesters organising people to go to that camp. Many of those people already have accommodation. Mark McGowan getting tough on those sleeping rough. The professional protesters who organise it are often people from organisations like Extinction Rebellion, basically anarchists, and they are coordinating this as some sort of protest movement. Extinction Rebellion insists it has nothing to do with the camp and the people we spoke to today say they have nowhere else to go. We are all homeless here, so, um, yeah, we're all looking to see if we can get somewhere to live. Yeah, to live. The camp initially formed over the Christmas period when social services shut down, but many have decided to stay. This afternoon, the opposition pledged an extra 100 beds for Fremantle's homeless if it wins the next election. We could all do with a little bit more compassion and a bit more humanity for the issues that are facing those who are street present and homeless here in Pioneer Park and right across the state. But the Premier says there is help out there for those in need. I just urge them, use the services that are there. We have spare beds currently. We have services available. Elizabeth Creasy, Nine News.